Hey everyone and welcome to this session in English 101 where we will go through like the building blocks of English through a uh, series of shorter, like very short uh, episodes where we talk about adjectives and adverbs, articles, genitives, nouns and verbs. And today we'll be focusing on adjectives and adverbs, thus we are crossing this one out. And I just want you to know that this is not something that's very in-depth, it's very basic, so it's used to repeat what you guys already know, in case you've forgotten. So, let's get into it. Adjectives and adverbs. So, if we start with the adjectives, they are basically used to describe the pronouns or the nouns, and we'll get to that in another episode about nouns, so don't worry about it. But we'll look at the examples here. As you can see in the middle, uh, if you look like this, right here, you have a sentence without adjectives. So basically the first one here is, the car was driving along the street. There's no adjective here. And how do you add an adjective then? Then look on the, this one here, sentence with adjective. The red car was driving along the busy street. So we've added words to describe our two, uh, our two nouns in here in this uh, sentence. So we have both the car, we're adding something to it, so we say it's red, and then we have the street as well, and we're saying that it's busy. Right? And then we have a second example here. Uh, the man was waiting. Not much to describe, but then we need move on to the other one. The ugly man was waiting. So what you're doing is that you're adding color to your sentences. You, you, like, you facilitate yourself into seeing what you're trying to describe. Because we're just saying the man was waiting. Yeah, it's a man. I don't know how he looks. But by adding ugly, you're showing some kind of attributes. You're showing who he is and what he can do. Or you get a sense of maybe how he looks like. That's why we use adjectives. So move on to adverbs and adverbs very similar in a certain sense that they're used to like add color uh, to uh, mainly the verb but they can also be used uh, in tandem with adjectives uh, and they so they describe how something is being done if a verb which we also will talk about in another episode um, is what we're doing or what is happening then the adverb describes how that happens. So, and they usually end uh, with ly. And we'll see how that works just here. So if we check here, the first one, there we have, they are careful drivers. Whereas careful is the adjective uh, that we talked about in the previous slide. Um, but there's no adverbs here. But then we can add an adverb if we check here. They are incredibly, notice the ly form, careful drivers. We're adding even more color than we had before. So this sentence, we already have an adjective, but we want more. Then we add an adverb that gives us even more descriptions about what's happening. So let's uh, just look at the uh, second sentence as well. Uh, he drives his car, whereas drives, in this case, is the verb. And then we want to describe how does he drive. Then we go, he drives his car carefully. Again, just adding something. Adding color, adding descriptions. That's what we're doing here. Uh, and right below this video, in the description, you'll find a couple of uh, sentences and some a very, very short exercise that you can look into just to refresh and see if you understood what this was all about. And uh, I just want to wish you good luck and I'll see you in the next episode.